What's going on folks? Welcome back to another Scum video. We have our second video for today and um, just as I was finishing up my last one they decided to drop the Halloween update and this is brilliant because I'm literally leaving like my apartment in like an hour so I'm really glad they dropped this before I left today which was amazing so I'm very happy about that and guys please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. I'm going to show you um, obviously all this stuff in game once I very quickly just run through um, the actual patch that they've, uh, they've put here. So they're actually saying here um, there's, they, they want to enhance some atmosphere. They say, good evening, everyone. Uh, are you ready for Spooktober? Well, we are. If you are not already shitting your pants every night on the Skull then let us enhance the atmosphere. And that is a word I really do like because atmosphere brings a whole level of uh, to the immersion, the immersive experience. So... We're going to have a look through here. We've got a blood moon. There is a new phenomenon on the Scum Island. The legend says some of the prisoners created a cult and executed some sort of a ritual. Anyway, they turned the moon red and with it some strange phenomenon uh, started occurring on the island. I don't know what this is. Could corpses start flying up on a red moon? I don't know. No idea. I'll try and show you in this video. If I, if I can't, then we'll just have to wait and see. Uh, the catacombs here. Hey you, yes you, do you like old adventure movies? Grew up watching Indiana Jones or The Mummy. Well, if you feel adventurous in any way, there is a surprise waiting for you at the old haunted house. I will not say any more, uh, not to destroy the sense of wonder. And I'm going to go through all this after. We've got some new emotes. Uh, let's be honest here, the biggest aspect of Halloween is dressing up and getting to do some shenanigans. Now you can already dress up in the game, but it's time to advance the level of shenanigans. We are adding the new thematic um, emotes for free. And you can see that if you hold down tab to get the, uh, to get the actual wheel up, you're going to be seeing some new emotes and stuff. Um, there are more surprises waiting for you on the island, but why spoil the surprise? So guys, get playing. This is going to be amazing. Um, right, we got a barber on the island now. He does look like John Blaze. I, it's got to be John Blaze. I don't care what anyone says. Hey there, sisters. You ready for the full fashion week? You're not. Don't worry. Got you covered. Prison at renowned uh, stylist and hairdresser pro prodigy Emmanuel has arrived and set up shop on the Scum Island. So basically, you can go in and you can just go and change your hairstyle, makeup and stuff like that for the females. And as it does state here, around here somewhere, um, you can, um, uh, we, we will have to wait for the males uh, rather as well. Uh, and these obviously are going to uh, gonna cost. Once you can afford the service and decide to treat yourself, uh, the day you will be taken to the hairdresser screen where you can change the style of your character with however you like to express yourself. Uh, we've got a new item in the game. We have a new item dropping in. Which uh, which one you ax? Ax? Uh, well, I am so glad you axed. Uh, meet trainers ax. So this is a trainers ax, ladies and gents. Um, so who is trainer, you ask? Okay, I'm done, I promise. Well, he is a prominent member of our community and an incredibly skilled blacksmith who handcrafted a couple of items from the game and sent them our way. You can check uh, out more of his work here. Now, I will be leaving the link in the description down below uh, so you guys can check this out. I love the look of this. This actually looks pretty badass. It looks like it's going to be, um, you know, fast, dangerous. It's not going to use too much stamina and stuff like that. It's not heavy. It doesn't look heavy anyway. Uh, we've got bug fixes here, so very important. Uh, I'm not going to go through any of these actually right now, um, but I want you guys to have a look here because a lot of this will change some of the gameplay and obviously QOLs as well um, will obviously change a lot of the game. Here they mentioned some M8, M8 2A1 and POSP scopes as well. So ladies and gents uh, and some admin commands too, um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go into the game and we're going to crack on and I'm going to show you some of these uh, new features. Let's do this. All right, welcome back, folks. We are at the old haunted house here, and you guys are going to absolutely love this. I haven't actually been down there, but I've just found out where the catacombs are, right? Um, so you're going to absolutely love this. And um, I've got, uh, I've currently, if you just check my inventory, just very quickly, guys, I've got Trainor's Axe here. Forged in the hottest flames of southern England and shaped to the most on the most epic anvil. This axe is a force to be reckoned with. It can also be used to chop vegetables as well. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to bring a female in, uh, a puppet, and you can see how fast... This thing is, obviously, if you've got full stamina, it's nice and light, and it does some damage, so that's all good. Um, and you can place it on your back as well, just like this. So where are the catacombs, guys? Where are they? I've checked everywhere here until I finally found it. Um, it turns out something is going to happen when I pull this sword here. Okay, so let's pull this sword. Oh, my... Oh, wow. Look, check this out. Check this out. I'm going to go first person here, guys. Okay, so we've now find, found the catacombs. This is going to be really cool. And I wonder what else is going to happen in here. Don't open. Dead inside. Oh, look at this. Look at the hole on the floor. 
What happens when you crawl inside? Oh, if only something was to jump out then. I was really hoping that was going to happen. So this is the first time I've seen this as well. And it's always great to see uh, the devs bringing in some creepy stuff. I've got a funny feeling something's going to be down here. I, I don't know, though. Um, but you can see all of these. Um, is that puppet moving? All right, we've got some pumpkins there. Let's let's head down here. I'm gonna. I'm actually gonna get. I'm actually gonna get trainer's axe out just in case. I don't know how big this place is. I don't know if it's small or if it's. Lo oh, is that a beeper? Oh my days! No, this is not good. Wow. Oh, this is this is the stuff they need in game like this. They need more stuff like this. This is brilliant. Getting massive Skyrim vibes or something here. Proper adventure. What's in there? Sacrifice. Okay, so you can't actually get in there. Okay. How far does this go? Where does this lead to? This is so strange. Can you climb up here? Yeah. This is so different from, from most things I've seen before. Um, where does this lead to then? Does this... Alright, let's just... Can we crawl out here? All right, let's crawl. Where does this take us out to? Oh, it takes us back out over here. No way. No way. That is actually really, really cool. A lot of people are going to be coming up this way, by the way, guys. So, uh, you know, everyone's going to be checking this Halloween update out. And something happening on the full moon as well. Where's the sword gone? Is it gone now? Oh, it's there. Sorry. Wrong one. So you can actually close it. And then you can reopen it as well. I see. Okay, so, ladies and gents, this is pretty much the uh, the best part of this video, which is going to be here. Don't forget, the um, the patch notes will be in the description below. So go and check out the QRLs and the bug fixes uh, before saying that something is broke or something isn't. Uh, I'm very surprised that these didn't wake up. They look like they probably are going to wake up or something's going to happen at some point and I'm just, you know, making this video too quick to figure out exactly what's going to happen. But they did say some other weird things are going to happen too and I hope that they really bring some atmosphere to the island, which is brilliant. So, ladies and gents, thank you so much for checking out this little video, little update. Um, and uh, go and have a blast. And uh, please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Stay safe.